shelves are full of sweet treats at Saris's Candies in Cannonsburg, but one Easter favorite is missing. New at 6, Channel 11's Liz Kilmer found out why you won't be able to get any of Saris's popular jelly beans this year. As we approach Easter and you prepare to pack those baskets, Saris Candies has you covered. You'll find a countless number of chocolate bunnies. Over here you have your peeps, but there is one staple that you won't find. It's a candy lover's paradise with shelves stocked full of chocolate and other treats. But this Easter at Sarah's Candies, shoppers can't find the jelly beans. I know my granddaughter's not going to be too happy, that's for sure. It's not an accident or a mistake, says president and CEO of the Cannonsburg operation, Bill Saris. He spilled the beans for us, saying it's a supply chain problem. Jelly beans have two things in them that are really important. Ours do pectin and starch, and you know they come from Ukraine. Bill says it's been an issue for quite some time now, causing a big impact to their bottom line. Normally, they sell hundreds of thousands of beans around Easter to customers who crave the popular recipe that's specially made by one of their suppliers. And they have a soft shell, and our, our customers really go crazy if we don't have them. And we tried to replace them uh, a year a year or so ago with, for Easter. And the repercussions were so bad that they said, you know, this is not you, this is not your bean. And so uh, we said this year, if we don't get what we want, we're not going to do them. These beans you see here are samples they tried from Europe, but Bill says they just don't live up to the Saris recipe. He promises they're working hard, they hear you, and they hope to have the beans back for next Easter if supply chain issues ease up. There's nothing else you can do. You know, we're fighting the same issues that everybody else is fighting. So, you know, everybody's on the same boat, and we're still rowing. Everybody's got an oar, they're rowing. In the meantime, customers like Kathy Haggerty have plenty of other delectable goodies to fill their baskets. Just so they don't do anything with the chocolate. Liz Kilmer, Channel 11 News.